we'll start with KSBY News reporter Angel Russell. She is live in Ventura County and has been to the fire's front lines. Angel, what have you seen today? Scott, seeing what we've seen the last few days, just this fire coming down from Los Padres National Forest, I first want to paint the picture of exactly where I'm at. I'm at Lake Casitas Recreation Area. This has been self-evacuated as a precaution since Tuesday, so nobody's actually here besides the workers in the fire department. Uh, east from Carpinteria, and we are six miles from Ojai. Uh, down here, the winds, not so bad, but all day, what they've been dealing with is those random bursts of Santa Ana winds. I'm going to go ahead and step out of this so you can take a look at the Los Padres National Forest, where that whole ridge is just burning up. Now, today, the story is firefighters are really trying to just get ahead of this fire. They know the direction is moving in that westerly area, but they also can't predict with how random these gusts of winds have been. So here's some footage from earlier of exactly how firefighters have been battling these flames. Take a look. So here we are off of Santa Ana Road near Highway 150. Uh, firefighters have been doing a backfiring operation in this area that proved to be very successful. What we're doing is we're trying to remove the fuels out from in front of the head of the fire and create a buffer so that the fire actually ran into this area and stopped. This fire was definitely wind driven. Uh, finally, Mother Nature has given us a little bit more of a reprieve today and the winds have, have lightened up a little bit, not much. Um, still with these low humidities, we are seeing spotting ahead of the fire. Now that we've seen uh, a diminishing wind, we can get our helicopters in to take care of some hot spots. This is a very uh, cavernous area with the different valleys and different uh, natural wind phenomena that occurs during different times of day. It's anybody's bet which direction this fire is going. Yes, there's still a tremendous potential for this fire for, for extreme growth. So we're doing our very best to, to get some solid line around it. Scott, I'm told the last time this area has burned behind me was back in the Wheeler fire, and that was in 1985. So do the math. There is a lot of dry fuel for this fire to really continue to burn. Scott? Angel, what are you noticing regarding the wind out there? Well, see, I'm in the valley area next to the lake, so it's really hard to determine what's going up there in Los Padres National Forest. But when I was up there earlier, just random gusts of that hot Santa Ana wind. But down here, very light breeze, but don't let that deceive you. We are very far from those flames, Scott. Thank you. Angel Russell reporting for us this evening.